All right, guys, how's it going? So, Marco Van Basten sends message to Liverpool over Arne Slot replacing Jurgen Klopp. Let's just go straight to his quotes. I think he's really good. I hope he stays in the Netherlands longer because it is an enrichment for Dutch football. He can really go anywhere. Bayern Munich, Liverpool, I'm really convinced of that. I've spoken to him a few times and I think what he does and what he sees is very strong. He gets along very well with the group of players, is tactically well-versed, can explain things well and is calm and intelligent. I think he can go to any club, even at the very difficult clubs, because he's so intelligent. He has a lot of qualities. And he shows it at every level. He first did it at AZ and now at Feyenoord. And Feyenoord is a really complicated club. He has been doing well for three years, while PS3 and Ajax have much more options in terms of money. You see, FSG would like that. He could really fit anywhere. If you get AZ and Feyenoord to play football, you'll also get big clubs like AC Milan to play football. You can clearly see his hand where he is the coach. I think it would be even easier for him at a high level because he has better players who understand his ideas faster. I also think he's smart enough to manage stubborn players. Uh, and former Netherlands international Wim Jong Jonk also backed slot to succeed at Liverpool. He gave Feyenoord a face. Arne has made enormous strides, so I would like that. Liverpool is also a bit like the Feyenoord of England. Uh, so there you go, some praise there for slot. Uh, Hugh is now a short, quite a short second favourite for the Liverpool job. No longer joint second favourite. Ruben uh, Amarin is the favourite around six to four now, which means you have to put four pounds on to make six profit. Uh, his price has you know, gone out, right? Uh, and slot is second favourite. I oh, can't remember, two and a half to one, probably five to two. Uh, and the Zerbi's gone quite out now to the third favourite. But I would say this, I wouldn't worry too much about the betting now. Now, I know that we've looked at the betting as a kind of an indicator of one of several factors that we take into account. It's good to see what the, the bookies are thinking. But I actually think that the bookmakers are playing a little bit with people at the moment with the betting odds. So I wouldn't pay too much uh, attention to those, to be honest with you. I think that the, it's all over the place at the moment, especially with the claims yesterday with West Ham and... Uh, just, just I, I just I get the impression that the bookies are trying it on a little bit at the moment to squeeze money out of people. That's their job, right? So uh, I'm not keeping too much of an eye on that at the moment. I will when things calm down a little bit. Um, so yeah, uh, this is uh, this chap is is being linked with Liverpool, which just doesn't uh, excite me whatsoever. Uh, as you know, I've always uh, you know. I would have liked Alonso because of the Liverpool connection and everything. I think he's a very good manager. Uh, Ruben Amorim was my second, uh, you know, or my preferred candidate if Alonso was never going to get the job. Uh, I have not seen him rivaled at all until now, but I'm starting to get a bit of a, you know, just a little bit of a concerning vibe with the circus, the demands. Uh, a bit like, you know, like, hang on a minute, know your fucking place, mate. We're Liverpool Football Club. You should be grateful if you've been given an, a contract opportunity or an employment opportunity, however you want to word it. Uh, and Liverpool won't take that shit. And I can't blame them. But some of these candidates that are being linked with us don't fill me with much fucking joy, to be honest. And I'm, I'm getting a little bit worried. So uh, let's just hope that the game plays out in a, in a suitable, sensible way. Um... If you were to ask me right now, today's time in the UK, it's probably about half past one. Uh, I think it's the 23rd of April, 2024. And they said 2026. Um, I, I, I personally still think that Ruben Amarin uh, is likely to get it. But I obviously do not know. And anything could happen. Uh, I might have a completely different feeling within an hour. All right, guys. So if you appreciate the video, please thumbs up the video. Drop me a comment. Buy me a coffee or a beer if you want to through the super thanks. Please read the video description. Uh, blah, 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 blah. All right, guys. Speak to you in a bit.